But this weekend, fabulous for gardening. But that's summer over. No, no, yeah, no. It yeah, it's yeah. just a noticeably <laughs> fresher feel of things today. And we had fairly cloudy skies at times too. But we did have some sunshine as well. And in fact, out of the blustery winds, it didn't feel too bad. Although, for some of us, nine degrees cooler today compared to yesterday. But temperatures, well, on average, should be around 14 Celsius at this time of year. So, overnight tonight, I think it will be largely dry, although this thicker cloud may produce a little bit of light rain and drizzle in places. And temperatures, I think, for many of us, staying in double figures, around 10 or 11 degrees Celsius, although in some spots under those clearer skies, they may fall a degree or so lower. And then tomorrow, we've got this weather front waving to the south, and I think that will push quite a lot of cloud around. Perhaps a bit of early brightness, but generally cloudy skies for us tomorrow and some outbreaks of rain. By the afternoon, some of this could be on the heavy side. And even if you don't see much in the way of rainfall, as I said, I think there will be a lot of cloud around tomorrow. Temperatures close to average for many of us. The highest expected in the south around 16 Celsius, 61 degrees Fahrenheit. And tomorrow, slightly less blustery winds. We're looking at a mainly light, perhaps moderate at times, southwesterly wind. And then on Wednesday, the weather front here pulls away. We've got low pressure to the north and that sets up this westerly flow. So I think on Wednesday, a lot of fine and dry weather with some sunshine, but with fairly unstable air. And as the temperatures rise, that may trigger off one or two showers. And these could be heavy with possibly some hail and thunder mixed in. But for many of us, I think temperatures will be close to average. And these westerly winds may pick up a little bit again on Wednesday. So as I said, a lot of fine and dry weather on Wednesday, but some showers and the same again on Thursday probably. But I think by Thursday, any showers probably lighter and we lose the risk of hail and thunder. And then a lot of uncertainty from Friday, but I think probably a dry start and then some rain pushing in. And then Saturday rain giving way to showers, possibly more rain on Sunday and fairly unsettled into next week. And maybe possibly a touch of frost on Thursday night. See you later.